Hello everyone, welcome to another repair video. In this video, I'm going to show you how to replace the Mavic Mini gimbal rubbers. This is uh, for the Mavic Mini 1. This gimbal was, uh, this drone was in a crash and after repairing the gimbal, one of the rubbers was broken. I managed to find this Mavic Mini uh, gimbal repair kit, which comes with a whole bunch of extras uh, that, some, that you don't need, but you can always keep it as spares. So it works out cheaper that if you buy this uh, little repair kit, then if you buy the rubbers uh, separately. Uh, the rubbers are available separately, but it's actually much better just to buy this little kit. And then you've got a whole bunch of extras uh, that you can use as spares if you have another repair. So in this, uh, in this little kit, you can get stickers, uh, little brackets, you get the status LED light cover, some gaskets, and what we need is the rubbers. So, it's quite difficult, uh, a lot of finessing to get this little rubber in, but you will see that this little rubber fits on perfectly. Um, you'll see that there is a little hole uh, that lines up with the bracket of the actual gimbal bracket. Uh, and then once that's lined up, that's the easy part. Now for the difficult part. The best way to do this is to first add the gimbal rubbers onto the gimbal, as you can see here, and line it up nice and perfectly. You'll see there's a little uh, hole that lines up. Um, there's a hole in the gimbal rubber, and when you put it over the bracket, then you know you fit it, fitted it correctly. Now comes the difficult part. The best way that I managed to find, find out how to do this was to use tweezers and as you can see I'm struggling a little bit here to get the the gimbal rubber through the body of the drone I just had to turn it sorry for this uh, these are the best angles I can give at the moment I'm working on a, a camera for a proper top view where I can zoom in much closer so uh, please uh, keep watching my channel uh, please subscribe guys and the videos I promise are only going to get better I really do appreciate it if you subscribe or comment or let me know if this video helped you. So now what I did was the other side of this gimbal rubber kept moving when I tried to pull it on the one side. Now you don't want to pull it too hard just in case the little gimbal rubber breaks. So as you pull on the one side, you use your tweezers to put it on through the other side. So you can see there's, there's that little hole, I'm pointing it out now, that's those rubbers must line up, the rubbers have a little hole, and then they line up with the gimbal there. If this video helped you, I would appreciate it if you guys would subscribe to the channel. Till next time guys, safe flying.